Hey guys, this is uh, News Now Nashville, News Now Nephew on a shooting on 3213 Dockside Drive. Don't know any other uh, uh, information on it. Family, probably. Yep, family. Let's walk on up. This is not Nephew, along with Miss Now Preston Nashville, on shooting at 3213 Dr. Brown. Hey, tight. Hey, tight. Yeah, that's why I wasn't going while he was talking to him. I wasn't going nowhere near while he was talking to him. Oh, we just got here. We're journalists. We just got here. Got Channel 2 and Channel 4 on the way. All we know is it's 3213. That was the address where the shooting went out at. It was a shooting? Yeah. You know who, you don't have me that who shot? Mm -mm. We just, we just got here. Just, the first crossing table, bro. Oh my god, I'm motherfucking crazy. Just calm down, bro. You don't need to go to jail for something I'm you didn't do. Happened. Oh, you was? Oh, no. Uh, I think, uh, yeah, we don't know if it's fatal or anything. They haven't said anything. That's probably a tentative suspect. Perfect. Oh, do you want me to move back a little, sir? Oh, uh, you're all right. We're going to go in front of you guys. Oh, okay. Does that guy go up to the mailbox? Yeah, we're going to go. So we're going to go to the mailbox and around that way. So just stay on the street. Okay. Yeah, yeah that's fine. Stage, I'll stand like right here. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's what I was planning on doing, officer. Can I get your name and badge number? It's officer West 256377. West 256377. Thank you. And can I get your employee number? And name, sir? Employee number 4001563. And your name? My name, Officer Vasquez. Thank you, sir. No, the ambulance was already left. Someone was in it. No, there's an ambulance right there. That's a fire truck. Oh, it is a fire truck. Oh, okay. The address is just 3213, is what the address says. My brother lives here. What about the drunk person that owns the house? Oh, no. I'm in the road. As long as we don't go past the yellow tape, we're good, Bubba. It's right there. It's right there. They're probably not going to let you up there yet, bro. I'll give you uh, one of my cards before we leave. And it's right here. When we first got here, when we started recording, you can see, okay? Probably news channel two or channel four. Huh? That's two. If I'm not mistaken, that's channel two. His brother could be right. You don't know that. Huh? 
Oh, that's a black guy over there. Oh, that's probably, um, yeah, Brandon. Up, yeah. can't go on that side. We're good right here. Trust me, if he wasn't, they would tell us. Hey guys, as soon as I can get a sergeant, I will uh, get y'all some information. Three, three weeks, uh, a little longer than that, um, like almost since the very end of April beginning. And the gentleman that you guys got was he living here too? No, I've never seen him. Uh, my brother was on the phone with me. I literally got in the door of the house and had a bit of That's the way to do it, buddy. Stand your ground. You sure you don't want to sit off? We are at the mailbox. He didn't specify. Yeah, he's an FTO. Okay. He's trying to find a sergeant instead of a field training officer. Huh? Well, yeah, he's busy right now. I can't go interrupt him.
Yeah. 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 Probably. We still got here before then. <coughs> Alright, man, look. We're out of here. Alright, you need to go to the hospital. You're going to have to tell where we Alright. Alright, bro. Keep yourself safe. Alright. So, a couple of minutes. So the injuries that you see, the thing that the lawyers are doing, the injuries that you see, I'm not really sure he had both arms around my neck from behind for a good minute. Well, there's a lot of drugs right there. Who's the guy that did it? Who's the dude that did this? I don't know. You have to ask them. You have to ask them. I do not know this. I've got this. Uh, I've got like uh, You need to stand by. Stuff Where's the guy that did this? One more time, okay? So I'll talk to you in a minute, okay? okay? I've just got you stand back. We'll take, we're going to get him. I promise you. We'll take care of him, okay? I was strong. You always do, right? <laughs> Are you, are you here to see brother? No. Yeah. Okay. So, the guy that did this, come over here. To the house. Okay. Let me explain Okay. Look at me. This is the guy's brother, everybody. Hey, Sergeant. What's that? By what I'm hearing over here with the victim, or one of the victims, is it was a robbery.
Who is the owner of the house? He's probably back there with the lights flashing off. I think his wife is back there. Uh, do you know the Yeah, I'll meet you there in a minute, man. Hey, officer. Is the I was talking to him. Is the sergeant still on the scene? It's up here on the right, right in front of the fire engine. Yep, thank you. Yeah, sorry. Two station. All right. Hey. Yeah, so what's going to happen whenever he goes? You said he's going to talk to him, but he's yeah, he staying didn't... somewhere. I'm like, sorry? I just need to know if I need to, like, get his car brought home. Like, what's going on? I don't know what's going on at all. I know he shouldn't sit in the road. So he's, it's not on the road. It's pulled over to the side. It's parked in a, on a curb, so it's fine it's there. It's legally parked. It's, yeah, it should be fine there. I made sure it was all locked up. Um, so nobody should be able to get into it. Okay. When we're going there, we process you can work out with him, like whether he needs to have you come pick him up or... Okay, just switch him to that. Thank you. Huh? I'm going to talk to you on the way. Okay. Hang up. Hang up. Where is the station? There was a shooter. The person's in the house that got shot. I don't know. That's what they were just telling me. That's what, they, that's what he was saying over here. I guess the stranger came in and we, well, as far as we know, his brother was in, was, a, was a roommate. Everybody was moving out. He came back to get some stuff. Uh, stranger that stayed, that stayed in the house with him. Yeah, I was asking you, was the sergeant still on the scene? Yes, sir. Okay. He's back there. Okay, he's the only one to give us an update, right? Correct. Okay, thank you. Be safe. Y'all have a good one. You too. I'm going to walk down here and see if I can get a... Yeah, I'm trying to get y'all with you guys. Can we get y'all on camera? I don't care. <laughs> Tell us what happened. Oh, we don't know what happened. We just pulled, they, up, we we pulled up. We pulled up right after they got here. The cop pulled his brother. Really? Yeah. Uh, what I was heard, what I heard over there was that the guy, um, some guy came into the house, mm -hmm. attacked him, and the guy who's going to the Hermitage Police Precinct is uh, going to be interviewed. He's going to the Hermitage. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. As far as we know, he, he was a roommate here, and um, he went to go come back to get some stuff, and he's moving out tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And a stranger had been came in the house. It was with the homeowner, and the stranger attacked him, and everything, and assaulted him. He's all really bad, messed up, and everything. And yeah, the guy, the uh, guy he took to the. Uh, so, uh, the dad, he mm -hmm. said he um, went. Um, the homeowner shot the other guy. Right. And he's inside the house still. Wow. And his brother's going to get interviewed. He's that's that's his other brother. He's coming to pick him up at the. Um, the precinct whenever we get through interviewing him and doing an investigation and everything and the sergeant is still on the scene he's going to let everybody else know more but as far as we know we know that there's one person that is dead or a fatal and the homeowner is in the white van over there the sergeant's over there and that's pretty much as far as we know okay so far but yeah i mean he's just uh the, the guy that was in the back of the cop car he had marks on his neck and all that and his hair, right here his hairline was yeah. he snatched his hair he had his hair snatched back and he's got lines right there with blood on his scalp he's got things around his, his uh, hand he's around his neck he's got a black eye he's got a busted lip wow. the young kid that was over here he's actually on the phone with the guy right 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 i was yeah. talking to him so basically he was evicted is that, that no, he was the victim. Oh, he was the victim. victim. He was moving yeah. out. Okay. Yeah. So he was moving out of the place, and then he got attacked. Yeah. Yeah, he's coming back. He came to get some small stuff, and we're gonna come back to get the rest of his other stuff. Tomorrow. That's as far as we know. I'm gonna try to get some information from a sergeant. Yeah. The sergeant's down there. He probably he's got a head of it, so he'll give us more information. 
we might, we might, that's what we know, it's not, it can be true yeah, yeah. or not true, but it's good to get all the sides. Okay. Yeah, we, we're not sure, for sure if it's the fatal or not, but okay. they said the guy was still in there that was shot, so. Okay, yeah, yeah. Hey, Sergeant. Yes, sir. Can you give us a little update? Channel 4 and us was wanting a little update. Uh, right now, all I can tell you is that we got one gunshot victim, and we're still trying to figure out what exactly happened. Okay. Uh, was Is the victim still in the house where we, we heard, or is he gone to the hospital? No, he's gone. He's gone? Yeah. Okay. So, we're just uh, still in the early stages of the investigation. And according to the gentleman that y'all just talked to his that was his brother and uh he's inter being interviewed right now at the Hermitage precinct the guy in the back oh, of the, cop the car. young guy yeah. yeah i'm not sure i the one that was talking to the detective mm -hmm. yeah yeah i have no idea mm -hmm. which uh, hospital did you say he was going to uh vanderbilt was it critical or non-critical i don't know yet don't know yet okay. okay still early stages okay okay so we're just trying to figure it out okay and can i get your name and employee number david bruce seven two five seven five eight Thank you. How much is precinct? Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank All you. Right. Thank All right. Y'all have a good one. Now be safe. Buddy. There you go, guys. We don't know if uh, it was a uh, fatal or not, but the guy was took to the hospital. So <laughs> we're not sure what's going on. Uh, I'm going to end it here in a minute, and I'm going to talk to local media off camera here for a minute. Uh, as you see, guys, there's the house right there. We, I we figured y'all were gonna. Yeah, we were. We've been covering ever since the standards went out. We, we caught a house and making house fire. That's how hard they do. Uh, awesome. Any of them. This is uh, News Now Preston signing off. Catch y'all on the next one. 416.